The state of Kenyan forest is worrying. Illegal logging is robbing the nation of its prized trees and the devastation perhaps scary. A state of affairs that led the government to place a 90 days ban on logging to take stock of what is remaining of its forest. And as Kenya joined the wall to mark the International Forest Day, not much can be celebrated in a nation that once enjoyed the green ambience of the flora. Environment Cabinet Secretary Kiriako Tobiko, who led the nation in marking the day, pointed an accusing finger at corrupt officers at the Kenya Forest Service. Those that do their job must be protected and must be defended, must be facilitated. But it is equally true that we have some rotten airports within, just like in every other institution. We have some rotten airports within the service. And for the sake of the country and for the sake of the institution, we must read them out. Due to a lot of misinformation fed to the board, we anonymously resolved today to invite agencies of government, including the EACC to come on board and assist in investigating the various concerns. We require this agency to investigate all within KFS without favor. The board was not aware that there was a task force in, in 2015 which produced the reports to the parent ministry flagging issues that would have been beneficial to this board in enhancing the resolution of issues that continue to ail the Kenya Forest Service and the forest sector in Kenya. To be called saying the nation has no option but to scale up its efforts in restoring the depleted forests. But as Tobiko was rooting for a collaborative approach in policing the forest, a lobby group in Garissa wants the reintroduction of customary institutions and laws in empowering the community in environment conservation. We are bringing back customary institutions and laws where the communities are themselves protecting their vegetation. If you cut an acacia tortillas, you are fined three goats. So the elders, until and unless you empower governance at the, at the community level, then there's nothing much you can do about it. In the Rakanivi, local administration has banned issuance of permits to cut trees either in forest or rural areas until further notice. <laughs> Ile miti iko huko kwa wananchi inaitwa community forest it is under county government lazima mshirikiane na ward administrator kuseme so and so alipanda miti imekoma anataka kukat ndio ripoti kuja kwa watu wa forest au waseme kama tukikata hii miti iko hapa yote kutaenda namna gani the day was marked under the theme forest and sustainable cities with a clear and call to make our cities greener healthier happier places to live